Welcome to my course on genome editing and engineering. We are discussing about applications of genome editing in treating human diseases. Uh, in the earlier lecture, we discussed about uh, hemophilia. Uh, we are continuing this uh, lecture as part B. Uh, uh, what are the available conventional treatments uh, in uh, hemophilia? Uh, there is a treatment called uh, desmopressin therapy. And uh, before that, uh, we have a look at this uh, molecule called uh, uh, vasopressin, uh, about which we will discuss. Uh, 1 D amino 8 D arginine vasopressin, also called as uh, desmopressin DD AVP, uh, it is a hormone uh, increases endogenous factor 8 levels in uh, hemophilia A. It can be administered uh, intravenously, subcutaneously or intranasally. It is a synthetic analog of uh, vasopressin and it uh, increases endogenous factor 8 plasma concentrations by 2 to 6 fold by inducing the release of von Willebrand factor, the carrier protein of factor 8 and the direct release of factor 8 from Weibel palate bodies in endothelial cells. However, uh, desmopressin is fruitful only for uh, moderate hemophilia A patients and not for uh, those having severe form of the disease. There are several drawbacks associated to DDAVP treatment, uh, particularly large uh, inter-individual variation in response uh, says it produces against its administration. Another conventional therapy is administration of clotting factor concentrates. Uh, clotting factor concentrates which are a, a recombinant or plasma derived concentrate of factor 8 or 9 are used to administer into patients to meet the deficiency of these factors. Uh, this is currently the gold standard treatment for hemophilia uh, called prophylactic factor replacement therapy where intravenous injection of factor 8 or 9 concentrates are given. The aim of prophylaxis is raising factor 8 and factor 9 activity above a detectable level uh, in order to prevent bleedings. Due to the short biological half-lives of factor 8 and factor 9 proteins, it requires frequent infusions 3 times a week for HA or twice a week for uh, HB. A serious complication of factor replacement therapy is the formation of factor 8 or factor 9 neutralizing LO inhibitory autoantibodies uh, rendering these ineffective which occurs in approximately 30 percent and 5 percent of patients with severe, severe hemophilia A and B uh, respectively. Administration of factor 9 in some inhibitor patients with HB uh, may induce severe allergic reactions including anaphylaxis. Patients with high tater uh, inhibitors 5-bethesta uh, unit uh, BU per ml or where one uh, Bethesda unit per ml reduces clotting factor activity by about 50 percent require bypassing as in example recombinant activated factor 7 or activated prothrombin complex concentrate. Uh, these are less efficacious and require more frequent infusions than factor concentrates in non inhibitor patients. Uh, ITI or immune tolerance induction therapy may be used against high titer inhibitors which entails many months or years of intensive up to twice daily factor treatment and is only effective in 70 percent and 30 percent of HA and HB patients respectively. What are the some of the advanced emerging treatments in hemophilia? Uh, one is extended half-life of factor 8 and uh, 9 concentrates. Half-life of factor 8, 9 recombinant concentrates uh, have been increased by fusion to uh, polyethylene uh, glycol. Uh, IgG1 FC or albumin. Uh, these extended half-life products help in significantly reducing the dosing frequencies in HB patients with more modest benefits in uh, a hemophilia A uh, where half-life is 14 to 19, eight, uh, 19 hours due to factor 8's requirements for uh, chaperoning by uh, von uh, Willebrand factor. These strategies are limited to a 1.3 to 1.5 fold half life extension of factor 8 because clearance of the recombinant protein from the blood is largely regulated by its interaction with uh, Willebrand 
uh, von Willebrand uh, factor. Uh, the various extended half life recombinant factor 8 products have improved the ABR annual uh, bleeding rate with values ranging from 1.2 to 1.9 and pivotal clinical studies showing a progressive decrease in ABR during extension uh, phases. Factor 8 mimetics or bispecific uh, antibodies. MEC Jumab, a novel bispecific monoclonal antibody uh, has been licensed in both the US and Europe for the prevention of bleeding in all patients with HA regardless of the presence or absence of uh, inhibitors. MEC Jumab recognizes both activated factor 9 and factor 10 and mimics factor 8A cofactor activity owing to its long half-life and subcutaneous uh, administration. Uh, MSS Jumab has significantly improved the treatment of hemophilia A by demonstrating a marked reduction in bleeding rates in clinical studies regardless of the presence of factor 8 uh, inhibitors. Further follow-up in post-marketing studies and within real-world settings is however required to provide further safety and efficacy of uh, MSC Jumab. Targeting of natural anticoagulant pathways. Individuals with hemophilia who co-inherit co pro-thrombotic mutations may show milder bleeding phenotypes. This observation prompted attempts to correct the bleeding phenotypes in hemophilia by downregulating natural anticoagulants thereby rebalancing hemostasis. Uh, novel agents targeting natural anticoagulants proteins are also in development in clinical and uh, preclinical studies. Uh, despite the number of agents under investigation, all of these approaches will at best result in uh, amelioration of bleeding phenotype and patients will continue to require conventional factor concentrate in the event of breakthrough bleeds, major trauma or uh, surgery. So, uh, to overcome all these disadvantages, one of the advancement has been made in the area of gene therapy. Uh, there have been many advancements in gene therapy for hemophilia and many small cell clinical trials has shown uh, promising results. The monogenic nature of hemophilia uh, as already stated and easily measurable laboratory uh, factor 8, factor 9 and clinical uh, bleed rate endpoints offer advantages to target hemophilia by uh, gene therapy. Considering the gene therapy viral vectors uh, induced it, uh, a malignancy and germline mutations in other diseases, uh, new vectors have been developed to uh, apply uh, in the case of hemophilia. Example recombinant ADN associated viral vectors have been found to be promising in hemophilia uh, treatment. A wild time AAV has not been reported to induce disease in human and recombinant AAV are modified to omit wild type viral calling sequences, uh, thus limiting the likely cell mediated immune responses to foreign viral uh, proteins. Let us have a small discussion on the adeno associated virus uh, vector uh, biology. Uh, the natural AAV stereo, uh, serotype contains three open reading frames uh, flanked by two inverted terminal repeats ITR, uh, capsid and uh, uh, replication. Uh, in in uh, recombinant AAVs, the viral genome is replaced by a synthetic expression cassette containing a uh, promoter. Uh, transin uh, of interest, uh, cDNA of uh, factor 8 or factor 9 in this case and a uh, terminator such as uh, uh, polyadenylation uh, signal flanked by the uh, ITRs. Cap and wrap sequences are supplied as a plasmid in uh, trans which will produce the viral capsid that packages the expression uh, cassette. To create a pseudotype vector, uh, example AAV2 oblique 1, the cap genes from another AAV serotype can be used to package the recombinant genome of another uh, serotype. Uh, uh, RAAVs can be customized at the capsid for tissue tropism and promoter for driving either ubiquitous or tissue specific expression of the uh, transient. AAV vectors package single stranded genomes and require host cell synthesis of the complementary strand for transduction which is one of the rate limiting steps for transient expression. Uh, single stranded DNA with a length of about 4.7 kilobases can exist either in plus or in minus form 
which requires a conversion into double stranded DNA either by strand annealing of 1 plus and 1 minus strand or by de novo synthesis of DNA prior to gene expression. To tackle this problem, self complementary uh, SCA vectors have been introduced as these vectors contain a dimeric inverted repeat uh, genome that allows folding into double stranded DNA. Uh, this approach has a major disadvantage as SCA vectors have even more limited coding capacity in comparison to SCA V. Therefore, it could be an obstacle in delivering large constructs containing full length genes. What are the factors that affect uh, the gene therapy outcome? The trends in delivery in gene therapy inside the cell of specific tissue can be uh, seen in this uh, picture. Uh, the vector uh, uptake uh, is happening over here and there is endosomal transport and escape and uh, nuclear entry uh, after which there is capsid uncoating synthesis of uh, transin then uh, there is uh, vector persistence transin expression and transgenic uh, protein synthesis and finally uh, secretion uh, taking place. The stages in AV vector delivery and transient expression are listed along with some of the uh, potential factors contributing to variable outcomes in AV based gene therapy method. Uh, we will discuss all these steps uh, uh, briefly uh, as uh, follows uh, vector uptake. Role neutralizing anti AV apps uh, numbers of glycan receptors the AV receptor and co receptors are uh, very important. Endosomal uh, transport and escape uh, following this vector uptake and then the nuclear entry and uncoating synthesis of transient of the uh, second strand and finally expression uh, of the transient and protein synthesis in uh, secretion. Uh, the vector persistence uh, percentage epigemal uh, percentage integrated influence of uh, concatamer formation genomic location of integrated copies all play uh, important uh, roles. Uh, the transient expression uh, variable transcriptional silencing and activation uh, uh, particularly with uh, stress response elements epigenetic remodeling of the transient are also equally uh, decisive. Transgenic protein synthesis, uh, the ER stress responses, aggregate formation and variable post transcriptional uh, modification plays important roles. The, uh, uh, in the secretion of the proteins and clearance interaction with the carrier protein and uh, clearance receptors are also uh, very, very uh, crucial. Uh, gene therapy in hemophilia B, the 1.5 kb cDNA is easily packaged into a range of viral vectors with expression mediated by liver specific regulatory elements targeting the native site of F9 production. Different AAV stereotypes uh, such as AAV2 or AAV8 factors having a liver specific expression cassette was infused into the hepatic artery. A vector dose dependent increase in circulating F9 or 1% to 6% was observed over a mean 3 year period which made it possible to reduce the frequency of prophylactic administration of factor 9 in a clinical study that used SCAAV2, 8, LP1, uh, ACE fix covector. Main difficulty uh, faced in this case was uh, developed uh, capsid specific antibodies and increase in hepatic enzyme levels of alanin transaminase indicating mild liver toxicity. Transines encoding wild type factor 9 have been replaced by factor 9 variants with higher activity such as the uh, Padua variant which contains a PR338L single amino acid substitution and shows eightfold higher activity in latest clinical uh, studies. Gene therapy in hemophilia A due to a larger size of the native uh, factor 8 cDNA which is about 9 kb. Uh, uh, it was difficult to package in clinically applicable vectors. However, deletion of sequence encoding a hematostatically statistically uh, sorry uh, I will repeat it like really. Okay, gene therapy in uh, hemophilia A. Due to a uh, larger size of the native factor 8 cDNA which is about 9 kb, it was difficult to package in clinically applicable vectors. However, deletion of sequence encoding a hemostatically uh, non-functional domain 
B domain deletion of factor 8 cDNA has allowed its incorporation into uh, AAV vectors. The first successful application of this approach was reported in uh, 2017 using an AV5 CoBDD factor 8 vector uh, in a dose escalation study in 9 patients. Application within the high dose cohort, uh, the factor 8 level was found to be increased to uh, more than 5 IU by DL uh, by uh, uh, weeks 2 to 9 rising into the normal range uh, in uh, 6 to 7 patients after week uh, 20. Stability of factor 8 expression was achieved at one year which reduced annualized bleed rate from 16 to 1 event uh, per year uh, in, in patients and this is a remarkable achievement. Increases in serum levels of alanine transaminase that indicate liver toxicity occurred in uh, 8 out of uh, 9 participants without an uh, associated cellular immune response uh, managed with uh, corticosteroids without change in uh, factor 8 trends in uh, expression. Uh, let us look into the expression uh, cassette of human factor 8 gene. Uh, this is the schematic uh, diagram of the expression cassette. The AC618 uh, construct consists of an AV8 vector encoding a cotton optimized a human uh, factor 8 gene that has been minimized by uh, deleting the uh, beta domain which has no any uh, function. The construct is designed to be specifically expressed in uh, liver cells. However, there are certain potential limitations of gene transfer with AAV vectors uh, like uh, vector immunogenicity. The presence of neutralizing antibodies against the AAV capsid can prevent cell transduction uh, whereas cytotoxic CD8 plus uh, T cell responses can eliminate AAV transduced cells that present AAV capsid antigens loaded on uh, MSC1 complexes. And the second is the potency and efficacy, the efficiency with which AAV vectors infect and transduce into the desired target cells can impact therapeutic doses and efficacy. And third is the genotoxicity. Although rare, the integration of the AAV vector DNA into the genome of the infected cell may have genotoxic effects. Uh, fourth is persistence. The episomal AAV genome uh, in the nucleus of the infected cells can be lost in conditions of cell proliferation such as liver growth which may impact therapeutic uh, efficacy. Beyond uh, gene uh, therapy, now there are several developments in the area of uh, gene editing therapies uh, for applications in hemophilia. Uh, gene editing technologies like Jerefin, Talon and CRISPR-Cas9 have been demonstrated in both hemophilia A and hemophilia B where many preclinical studies have shown promising uh, results. ZFNs are the uh, uh, only in vivo gene editing system in uh, hemophilia clinical trials uh, currently. Uh, SB factor 9 is developed by Sangamo Therapeutics, uh, uh, which is an uh, investigative jink finger nucleus based gene therapy for hemophilia B. Uh, under clinical trial uh, phase 1. Uh, ascending dose study in 3 cohorts low, medium and high of genome editing by jink finger nuclease therapeutic SVF9 in subjects with uh, severe hemophilia uh, B has been uh, conducted. Uh, patients uh, inclusion criteria were uh, males uh, more than 18 years of age and severe hemophilia B. Uh, having native circulating factor 9 activity uh, uh, more than 1% uh, with or uh, without uh, cross reactive uh, material. Uh, let us discuss about the in vivo gene editing uh, by Jedefin for hemophilia. Uh, a 2018 phase 1 trial uh, infused SB factor 9 hemophilia B gene therapy consisting of 3 liver tropic AV uh, 2 by 6 vectors each delivering one of the three components a right or left ginger jellyfin uh, or a normal F9 uh, transient. The jellyfins are designed to place the normal copy of the clotting factor gene within the albumin intron 1 
under control of the endogenous albumin locus uh, promoter. Preclinical studies showed that co-delivering AV8 containing a gelatin pair targeting murine albumin intron 1 with AV8 containing a splice acceptor signal promoterless F9 transin uh, exon to 8 and poly A sequence flanked by uh, homologous arms to intron 1 can increase F9 uh, levels proportionally to the vector dose. Uh, even when only 0.5% uh, of the murine transcripts were mutated, high levels of F9 were sustained for more than a year with no change in plasma uh, albumin. Okay, so uh, let us look into the schematics of uh, gene editing by AAB uh, delivered uh, zinc finger nucleases and donor uh, DNA uh, template. Uh, the AAV expressed uh, gelatin uh, fuses a FOC1 endonuclease to uh, GLF DNA binding uh, domain uh, as done uh, usually. Gelatin binding domain targets a specific sequence and then the cleavage domain induces a double strand break. DSB can be repaired by homologous recombination if a donor DNA template is present with flanking arms uh, homologous to the DNA at the cleavage site. Flanking uh, the clotting factor uh, cDNA uh, is a poly A sequence uh, PA as you can uh, see here which splices the transcribed clotting factor RNA to the splice donor SD of albumin uh, exon 1 RNA to produce an mRNA uh, fusion transcript. The mRNA fusion transcript is translated into secreted uh, clotting uh, factor uh, proteins finally. There have been other attempts uh, using uh, talent gene editing technologies for genetic correction of mutated uh, FA gene. The intron uh, 22 inversion which we have discussed in part A, uh, a mutation of F8 causes about uh, 48, 45 percent of severe hemophilia A case uh, where this uh, 0.6 uh, 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 MB inversion splits the 186 KB uh, F8 gene into two parts with opposite transcription directions. The inverted 5 prime part preserves the first 22 exons. Uh, leading to a truncated F8 transcript due to the lack of the last 627 base pair coding sequences of exons 23 to 26. Uh, Wu et al. Uh, 2016 carried out a, an in situ genetic correction of uh, uh, inversion 2 22 in patient specific induced pluripotent stem cells uh, by using talon. Uh, through this strategy, the 627 base pair sequence plus a poly A signal was precisely targeted at the junction of exon 22 and intron 22 via uh, homologous recombination repair with high targeting efficiencies of 62.5 and 52.9 percent respectively. The gene corrected IPSs retained a normal karyotype following removal of drug selection cassette using a Cree uh, lock speed system. Uh, F8 Transcription and factor 8 secretion were observed uh, endothelial cells and mesenchymal stem cells derived from the gene corrected IPSCs. There have been also some effort uh, in talent design uh, and detection of the indels, uh, two pairs of the talents precisely uh, targeting at the junction of exon 22 and intron 22 of F8 was designed and uh, constructed. Uh, they are designated as L1 R1 and L2 R2. Prior uh, to gene targeting, the cleavage activity of the talents were tested in uh, HET uh, 293T cells. Talent pairs were transiently expressed in HET 293T uh, cells and then the genomic regions encompassing the nucleus target site was PCI amplified, cloned and sequenced. For each talent pair, 22 sequences were obtained through Sanger sequencing out of which 6 and 3 mutated alleles were identified for L1 R1 and L2 R2 respectively indicating the corresponding gene disrupting rates of 27.3 percent and 
0.6 percent respectively. The cleavage activity were also evaluated by T7 endonuclease assay where nucleus target sites was PC amplified and digested with the mismatch sensitive T7 E1. After electrophoresis both the cleaved and uncleaved fragments were quantified from gel bands. So, here you can see uh, the various results uh, as presented in uh, figure A, B, C, D. A is the design of the two pairs of, of the talents uh, L1 and uh, L2. Asterisk indicates the junction of uh, exon uh, 22 uh, and intron uh, 22. The underlying letters indicate the binding sites uh, of the uh, talents. Uh, in B and C, uh, uh, we can see the results of the Sanger sequencing of the indels induced by each tail and pair in HAC 293 T cells. Uh, WT stands for uh, wild type uh, and uh, the delta uh, is uh, standing for deletion. In figure D, we can see the T7 uh, E1 assay of cutting activity of uh, L1 R1 at designed uh, target site and 6 potential off target sites. And the percentage of indels was uh, indicated uh, in the figure. The gels represented uh, in the uh, full length uh, uh, gels. A nuclear fraction into patient specific uh, IPSCs. A donor vector containing the coding sequence of action 23, 26 on SG40 poly A signal and a flux to PGK neo cassette was uh, constructed. The sequences were flanked by an 899 base pair left homologous arm and a 909 base pair right arm. Patient specific IPSCs were generated from uh, an outgrowth uh, epithelial cells derived from cells in urine sample of a patient. To perform gene targeting, talents and linearized donor vectors were nucleofected into the patient's specific IPSCs. After two weeks of drug selection with G4 one eight single cell colonies were individually picked up and expanded, followed by initially PCR screen for targeted integration at both 5 prime and 3 prime sites and Sanger sequencing of PCR products. Both the patient original and gene corrected IPSCs were differentiated into uh, ECs to test the F8 uh, expression. Uh, the targeting vector uh, will uh, integrate the coding sequence of exon 23 to 26 and SVO 40 poly A signal and a flux PG K neo cassette at the junction of exon 22 and intron uh, 22. Talents were used to stimulate the homologous recombination. Primers uh, F1, uh, R1 and F2, R2 were used in uh, PCR uh, screening. You can see here uh, F1 and uh, R2 and uh, F2 and uh, R1. Probe uh, used in southern blot was located in uh, intron 22. Then the flux PGK neo cassette was removed from the genome using a Cre lock space system. Uh, primers F3 and R3 uh, were used in the uh, PCR uh, screen. Uh, of excision, all the sizes of the restriction fragments in southern blood analysis are also shown. Uh, one of the uh, uh, recent uh, uh, approach uh, is the use of CRISPR-Cas9 based gene editing uh, to reframe uh, mutated uh, factor 8 uh, open reading frames. Uh, the function of the beta domain of the F8 gene remains uh, unclear. Although some studies have suggested it is associated with intracellular synthesis, secretion, activation, inactivation and clearance of uh, factor 8 while some uh, uh, say uh, it is not very uh, of uh, crucial importance. Recombinant B domain uh, deleted uh, factor 8, uh, BDD minus uh, factor 8 has been demonstrated to be effective in uh, clinical applications. Uh, gene addition of uh, BDD F uh, minus F8 cDNA rescued the phenotype in HA uh, model mice and a phase uh, 1 oblique 2 clinical trial demonstrated the effectiveness of AV5 uh, uh, BDD minus uh, F8 uh, gene uh, transfer. 
a 4 base pair frame seat uh, deletion uh, within the beta domain B domain in exon 14 results in premature termination of factor 8 translation or uh, factor 8 truncation uh, causing uh, severe uh, HA. A strategy adopted by Hu et al. Uh, 2019 induced a 54 base pair deletion spanning intrinsic 4 base pair deletion of B domain to reframe the F8 open reading frame in HA uh, induced pluripotent stem cells using single stranded uh, ODN and CRISPR uh, Cas9. The designation of single guide RNA is restricted by the protospressor adjustment motif. Uh, so, the minimal deletion that could be achieved is 54 base pairs including the 4 base pairs frame shift deletion of the B domain in exon 14 of the F8 gene. Since cDNA of F8 is too large to be packaged into adeno associated virus capsids for gene transfer, uh, therefore use of single stranded uh, oligonucleotide mediated in frame deletion can be an alternative effective method. To perform uh, gene targeting, plasmids expand expressing sgRNAs and the CRISPR Cas9 complex and uh, SSODN were uh, nucleofected into the uh, hemophilia A uh, induced pluripotent stem cells. After nucleofaction with CRISPR Cas9 and SSODN, the HA iPSCs were dissociated into single cells plated on murine embryonic fibroblast feeder cells without drug selection and then picked and uh, expanded. Uh, factor 8 expression and uh, secretion were restored in endothelial uh, progenitor cells, and factor 8 activity and the bleeding phenotype were rescued in hemophilia A mice after transplantation of uh, C IEPCs. Schematic representation of CRISPR Cas9 mediated uh, precise deletion. Uh, the design of two sgRNAs for F8 exon 14 um, is shown in this figure. The red uh, dotted lines uh, as you can see in the uh, center indicates a C dot. 3167 del CTGA. Uh, the green letters indicate the sgRNA sequences and blue letters indicate the protospecer adjacent motif. The red arrows represent predicted CRISPR Cas9 cleavage sites. The reframed F8 exhibits a precise 50 base pair deletion and correction of the reading frame of frame shift mutations in this uh, region. The vertical line uh, indicates the upstream and downstream connections. Uh, yellow shaped bases are left homologous sequences and gray shaped bases are the right uh, homologous uh, sequences. Uh, here is the results of the Sanger sequencing of the indels uh, induced by F8 E14 SZ1 or F8 E14 SZ2 in uh, uh, hemophilia A IP assays. The black arrow indicates the position of uh, insertion. Uh, the blue leveled bases are the palm sequences of the CRISPR Cas9. The target sequence of sgRNA is shown in uh, green color in the center. Uh, red indicates inserted uh, bases. WT stands for wild type. Uh, delta stands for deletion. Plus stands for insertion. And uh, the X or cross uh, indicates uh, the times. Uh, analysis of corrected IPSCs. Uh, uh, showed the uh, following uh, results two stably corrected clones, two 6 IPSCs, and two 4 6 IPSCs were randomly selected for further research, in which the targeted deletion of 50 base pairs was verified by PCR and Sanger sequencing, as uh, discussed earlier. Uh, in figure C, you can see the PCR based screening of uh, C IPSCs. The size of the PCR products were around uh, 448 base pairs for the 50 base pair deletion, 502 base pairs for the normal IPSCs 
and 498 base pairs for the HAIPSC simplified using the primer pair F8, E14, uh, F oblique R. In figure D, we can see the PCA products uh, sequenced by uh, Sanger sequencing in addition uh, 2 6 IPSCs and uh, uh, 2 4 6 IPSCs were shown to be pluripotent by immunofluorescence and were uh, karyotypically uh, normal. Uh, there was also concern of off target uh, hits and uh, off target analysis was carried out. Uh, to analyze the off target activity of CRISPR Cas9 genomic DNA was isolated from the HA IPSCs and C IPSCs. Uh, both uh, 26 IPSC and 246 uh, IPSCs. Uh, primers were uh, selected and designed to amplify the 5 potential off target sites for F8, uh, E14SG1 and F8, E14SG2 respectively that were predicted by the optimized CRISPR design website. The DNA of the C IPSCs was amplified by PCR and sequenced and no indels were observed upon comparison with the HA IPSCs. Unintended mutations after CRISPR Cas9 editing in the C IPSCs were investigated by comparison with the AC IPSCs using whole exome uh, sequencing. Uh, in brief, no off target indels were identified upon comparison of the potential off target sites with the indel uh, locations identified by WES. Uh, therefore, uh, CRISPR Cas9 uh, as a uh, gene editing uh, tool has uh, large. Uh, uh, application potentials uh, in the treatment of uh, hemophilia. With this, we come to end of this uh, uh, lecture. Uh, these are some of the references from which uh, we have uh, taken materials for preparing uh, this uh, particular uh, lecture and thank you for your uh, patient hearing. Mm -hmm.